bleeding heart liberal Joe Rogan says he'd vote for Trump before Biden because he's mentally gone, putting him mildly. And Americans now have to rely on his sideshow of diversity administration. Oh, Joe Rogan makes headlines literally for just saying stuff. <laughs> I mean, I really, Joe Rogan said, and it's like the most mild opinion. Like, yeah, I don't know. I might vote for Trump. We'll see. I might do this thing. And it, it makes headlines. But, I mean, he's the most popular podcast out there. People are listening to him left or right, uh, and he's he, he he's waking up. He's a what many would call a dissenting voice. I don't agree with most of out of, of what's out of his mouth, but he's coming around. Joe Rogan is so turned off by President Biden's performance that he says he would rather vote for Trump in 2024. I mean, I would hope after all this crap. It's bizarre how far he's deteriorated. And I, you know, when I was talking about it during the the election. Uh, and people were like, I was actually talking about with Eric Weinstein and he was like, I mean, I can't vote for Biden. And he goes, I can't vote for Trump. And I go, I would vote for Trump before I'd vote for Biden. Just because I think with Biden, like he's no, he's, he's gone. Like, you know, he's gone. It's, you're going to be relying on his cabinet. And I knew his cabinet would be this sideshow of diversity. Russell Brand, who was his guest, added, I feel that sometimes that Joe Biden is the perfect president for the time because he's like the perfect metaphor of what it is. The system is over. That's perfect. Absolutely. Brand added that Democrats may have managed to make ordinary Americans hate each other. That's true. You can't criminalize half a country and say that they're far right fascists any more than you could say, in my view, extreme leftists. Donald Trump and the MAGA Republicans represent an extremism that threatens the very foundations of our republic. Nazi fags. Rogan garnered support from some far right. I <laughs> like how <laughs> he just said you can't keep calling everyone far right fascists and then the Daily Beast just goes right back in far right Republicans. Of course, any even slightly dissenting voice that say far right. He, however, insisted afterwards, and this is born here, afterwards that he is a bleeding heart liberal who would never vote red. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments about all this. I... I I don't know, what are your thoughts on Joe Rogan? What he says? Drop it in the comments below. Like and subscribe if you want to support the channel. It helps tremendously. Appreciate you guys, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.